Today's high-end performance sleds come with more and more sophisticated suspension and shock setups year after year. Generally speaking, the average rider doesn't think they take full advantage of the adjustability offered by even factory shocks. But take this adjustability away and suddenly it becomes clear just how useful it was. Proof of this phenomenon can be found on the front of the 2013 Skidoo Renegade 800X package. Skidoo decided to remove the fully adjustable remote reservoir piggyback KYB shocks from all of their X package sleds a few seasons ago. I guess they figured nobody would notice and the lack of adjustability wouldn't be a big deal. I hate to say it, but they were wrong. Luckily for all you Skidoo riders out there, Fox has the answer to this conundrum. It comes in the form of their Ultra Trick Float X Evol IFS shock specifically designed and tuned for the front of a Skidoo Rev XP or XS chassis. Fox Float X Evol shocks are the pinnacle of snowmobile shock technology. They feature an infinitely adjustable air spring chamber to save weight, reservoirs for increased shock stroke, added oil capacity and better oil cooling, and anodized caps on all externally threaded openings. Installation of the Float X E-Ball shocks is about as basic as a snowmobile upgrade can get. Two bolts to remove the stock shocks, two bolts to install the Fox shocks, and you're back on the snow. The most difficult part of the whole process is getting a wrench on the top shock mount bolt under the rev bodywork. Right up front, let's just say it. Showing up with a set of Fox Float X E-Balls on the front of your sled is kind of like showing up to McDonald's in a Lamborghini everybody drops their nuggets and runs over to have a look. Their piggyback reservoir and cool shock shaft guards look like something you'd find on a Pro Mod race sled, but peeking just under the rear of the shock, you find an Evol chamber. This is where the real magic of this setup is hidden. The Evol chamber is a second, separately adjustable air reservoir that affects the progressive feel of the air spring and helps resist bottoming at the very end of the shock stroke. The Evol chamber is adjusted independently but in conjunction with the main air chamber, allowing a rider to tune not only for weight and ride height, but for spring rate and anti-bottoming resistance as well. Combine this adjustability with high and low speed compression and rebound clickers and you truly have the most adjustable shock setup ever offered to trail riders. Since it didn't take long to install the Float X Evols on our 800 Renegade, I decided to take them out and see how they worked. Now I know this comment isn't in relation to performance, but man, do these things ever look cool. They definitely increase your mental horsepower. On the trail, I was able to tweak the Float X's clickers to suit my riding style and the trail conditions. When things were smooth, I turned down the high-speed compression clickers to provide a softer front-end ride. When the bumps got bigger though, it only took a few seconds to bump up the compression clickers a few notches to stiffen up the ride and help prevent the shocks from stroking through their travel too quickly. On a typical trail, I really do feel the Float X Evolves made a marked improvement in ride quality on our XS chassis Renegade 800, but I wanted to push their limits a bit and see how they could handle just a little bit more abuse. I managed to find a rough section of trail on a portage between two lakes that had some bigger bumps and even a few decent sized launches. What I was really looking to test was the bottoming resistance provided by the Evol chamber. With a mix of a bit more compression and the Evol chamber pressure set to provide a more progressive air spring curve, the Float X's soaked up any gnarly square edge crater I could pound the sled into. Even landing a few pretty decent launches, I didn't experience any harsh bottoming at all. At the end of the day, I've come to the conclusion that Fox is delivering on everything they promised with the Float X Evols. They are not just bling. They do improve the ride of your sled in any real world condition. And even some extreme conditions, very few will ever have the opportunity to conquer.